Hey everyone, in this video, I'm going to show you how to stop Cut from updating automatically and use the pro features which are available in the free version previously. CatCut tends to actually update itself without asking, which can be very frustrating, especially if you want to stick with a specific version. So today I'll walk you through a very simple trick to prevent it from updating. First of all, to demonstrate, I'll first install the CatCut older version 3.9, which you can get at GitHub. Uh, the link I'm going to show you at the description uh, below. So uh, let me show you the GitHub link, the GitHub link. Okay, and at GitHub, okay, at GitHub. So you go all the way down, for me I'll choose 3.0 version, this version. It's up to you which version you want to use. So I already downloaded and installed the 3.9 version. Okay, 3.9 version. The, I was using some old version and then they auto update to the newest uh, version, which actually removed uh, quite a lot of features uh, which become from free version, they become a full version to pay for it. So for example, like stabilization, and then now you want to export out, right? You have to use the pro version. So it's best to actually downgrade to an older version, which doesn't have the restriction. We can use the features that is now in the pro version. Previously, it was in the older version. Okay, so you can come to this website. I'll put it in the description uh, in this video below. Okay. Now let's look at the CapCup software itself. The 3.9 version software I'm now using. So this is the software. Okay, how do you check the version over here? Check the version, it's actually down here. Version 3.9.0. Okay, and then you saw this. Try beta test version to enjoy the new features. Check for updates. Click and tick this. So yeah, then uh, cat card should not be installing the update. But you know what? Even though you uncheck this right, I notice it will still auto update by itself. So I'm going to teach you a workaround uh way to actually uh preventing it from installing the update. Okay, preventing it from installing the update. Okay, first you need to go to your file explorer, file explorer, Windows file explorer. Okay, Windows file explorer. Okay, then uh, you go into the app data local folder. So you come here, you just type add data. Okay. Enter app data and then look for cap cut. Under local, okay, app data local. Look for CatCup. Okay, look for CatCup and then under the user data, download. Okay, down here. So I want you to create a new file. Right click your mouse. Click under new folder. Sorry, not a new folder. It's actually, uh, it's a new folder. A new file, sorry. New file, new text file. Uh, it's really not a text file, it's just a ESC file. I'm going to call it um, update.exe. Okay, go ahead, change it. Change it. And then Right click a mouse, go to properties, 
change this to read only and then click apply okay so what this does is actually um, prevent the auto update right to be actually auto install because this is a read only uh, feature it cannot install in your uh, system so that's a way to prevent get cover from auto update that's the uh, trick to prevent it from auto update without your permission so that's it I hope you find this uh, helpful uh, if you find this helpful, right, please click the like button and subscribe to my channel uh, for more uh, new updates, uh, any help that I will think, can think of. Thanks for watching. Bye.